Basra Province, 1978. Huda fished the knife from the pocket of her long apricot dress. Rania eyed the Jambia's sharp tip and buffalo horn handle and grinned in approval. That's perfect for our oath. Amber eyes dilated with a jittery mix of fear and anticipation. It's even better than the knife in the American movie. Last week, I saw a real American, a woman, said the younger girl proudly. She was on the Cornish, eating ice cream and watching the boats. I've seen plenty of foreign women in Baghdad, said her 14-year-old companion, not to be outdone. Teachers and nurses, mostly. They like to picnic by the Tigris. Do you think they've ever sworn an oath like this? Huda stared up at Rania. She'd grown taller and slimmer in the three months she'd been away at the prestigious Baghdad Ladies High School. Huda felt dowdy beside her, even in her favorite dress. What should we say, she asked. These lines were read by Caitlin, and they come from the book When the Apricots Bloom by Gina Wilkinson.